Now, while the whole wide world is busy celebrating Julian Alfred for the gold medal she won, I think it's finally time I draw your attention to what happened to African fastest woman, Mari Jusitulu. If you watch the 100 meter women final, if you pay attention, you will see that Mari Jusitalo did not finish the race, right? Did you care to ask what happened to her? Well, the fastest African woman, Mari Jusitalo, I am so sad to break this news, but she has been thrown into the biggest injury of her career. This is Marie Jusitalo, and this picture you're seeing on your screen is demonstrating the moment she got injured. Tia Clinton was right after her, ahead of her, and she was the last, she placed the last position. And the picture by your right hand side is when she was being placed on a chair, because I think the injury was too too much that she could not even walk. I really feel very sad for this woman because even Shelly and Fraser Fries knows and she always pray for Marie Jusit to finally get a major championship medal. Unfortunately, life happens. In fact, she is the favorite sprinter i was anticipating to win a medal at the 100 meter final unfortunately life happens she even has the fastest time in the first hit of the women 100 meters now i see a lot of people complaining why why shelly and fraser fries decided not to race look some rejections are blessings in disgust. When some failure are blessings in disgust. So no, do not bother yourself about why Shelly and Fraser Fry did not race. Rather, you should be grateful to God because you did not know. You do not know what God um, decided to protect against Shelly and Fraser Fry. You do not know. Maybe... If Shelly and Fraser Fries could have raced in the women 100 meter final, she would end up getting the biggest injury of her career. Look what happened to Marie Juzi Talao. So you need to be grateful instead of complaining because some failure, some rejections are blessings in disgust. So be careful how you complain, be careful how you worry about things that do not happen we do not have control over things that happen to us stop having this mentality of you are going to have control over everything so be grateful for the fact that shelly did not raise because you do not know what the universe decided to protect away make sure to like and subscribe